All right, and we're back with Mass Effect 3. When we last left off, ooh, some credits, nice. We, nice, were landing on a Cerberus base to find out what they know about about uh, the Reapers and what they're doing with the Reaper tech. So far, we've really found nothing. But that's from a lack of trying, not from a lack of there being stuff, I'm sure. See Televi. Integration successful. Suicide on capture orders confirmed. Cerberus is my friend. Obey. Protect the human humanity at any cost. So, integration is starting to sound like um, indoctrination, which is interesting. What the hell is this? Well, that's weird looking. Guess we found it. He's got the sample. Roger that. Meet you at the landing pad. Why was that specific example the one we wanted? Oh, it doesn't matter. I do like how we can just run now. Uh, Did Good I just work. see somebody get teleported in? I do like how... Ooh, he just melted. I do like how, uh... Pool doesn't miss anymore. It just, uh, ooh, shit. I thought that was gonna hit me for sure. It only misses if I do that. Alright, we're doing good. Where's this next one? Alright, so it's not this one. Sounds simple enough. Never said it would be easy. Oh, hey. It can miss, but as long as you've got somebody in front of you. Fucking punch to the face. Uh Oh wow, look at that blood spray. this. Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> Middle of a gunfight. What is that? Oh. Stay focused. This isn't over yet. I could do this all day. Fuck. What the hell's my team? I'm not sure if I like this AI. It seems to be just going off on its own, which is good in one way. Because I don't have to micromanage. But it's also, what if I needed it? You know? 
That's kind of worrying. <laughs> Whoa. Up you get. I got your back. For ten, you copy. You'll make it. Let's just keep the landing pad clear. Switch out guns. Been using that the whole time. Let's uh not a sniper rifle time. that thing we're at the extraction point ready for pickup can we grenade that nice Liara. All right. Fun little side mission. The only reason I'm really questioning if, uh, like, it's going to Commander, we've got our best know, engineers keep this on the line. What was Cerberus doing with it? We don't know yet, but whatever Cerberus is up to, it can't be good. Even if we can't determine its purpose, we've disrupted their experiments. I doubt they'll just close up shop. Agreed. We'll keep sending strikes against the facility. Good work, Commander. Hmm. Right, what I was saying... What was I saying? 10,000 credits. <laughs> 10,000 credits is enough to make me forget what I was saying. Um... Words, 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 words. <sighs> I was getting on the ship. Um, ah, whatever. All right, crucible. What's crucible? Device will require entire systems of resources and skilled workers, as well as galaxy's brightest science. Galaxy's brightest scientists. Javelin missile launchers developed by the Alliance. Javelin missiles release dark energy upon impact. This creates devastating space-time disruptions, magnified warp fields that strip away a target's molecular bonds. Even the strongest kinetic barriers will eventually collapse after multiple impacts from these rockets. Alliance R&D commandeered several colonies, factories, and now produces enough Javelin missile launchers for all dreadnoughts in the Alliance fleet. Alright, so that's good. Data liberated from a cert liberated nice. Oh right, um, the thing I was saying. Uh, the reason I think I feel like I'm on such a stringent timeline is just the way everything feels, especially when it said, "Oh hey, do you want to go see Ashley or do you want to go to the Citadel, for, like the, see the Council first? It made it seem very much like if I didn't see go see the Castle Council first, then bad things would happen. But you know, well, Ashley's more important. So that wasn't a very good thing to test that on, but... Right. Anyways. Anything new with the Alliance? Updated, nicknamed, Bridge Burners. 
Team Zeta are combat engineers who specialize in destroying enemy fortifications in hostile territory. This tight-knit group of men and women are respected for their knowledge, renowned for their tenacity, and infamous for their th enthusiasm. See, it feels like that I should be able to do something about that. I don't know. Well, let's look at the war map. What do we have going on? Come on. Come on, game. Nothing's really changed. I mean... Okay. That's kind of aggravating, especially since I just spent some time. But whatevs. It'd be cool, yo. Alright, I'm going to go through a few people. Ah, oh, cheers, thank you. You have an upgrade waiting. Do you recommend to Shepard some of the data you allowed me to access or research for you? You found a, what <laughs> some of the data you found allowed me to research and upgrade for you. Simply access the terminal in Dr. Sony's office at your convenience. You may choose how and when to implement. Have a pleasant day. All right, cheers. Let's uh, let's go see Dr. Sony's office. Um, that was on the third deck, I think. Test out your weapons on the Citadel's firing... Fuck you too, game. <laughs> Something about the Citadel's firing range. Well, let's go see it. And that... is a dead bug. Dr. Tassoni found useful information in the day. Yeah, shut up. Thank you. This field kit can be used for a one-time upgrade to a variety of weapons to increase ammo capacity or the potential damage dealt. Schematics have been scanned into the Normandy's onboard computer. Uh, I, I, I can... Hmm. Damage. No. Ammo. Damage. Ammo. Damage. Ammo. Damage. You recovered, Commander. Open damage bonus. Protein notes. Wow. <sighs> Glyph, remind me to clean up these old notes. Perhaps reviewing them will lead to something useful for Protein device. Liara. Okay, so 2171 to 2185, something useful may be found in here about the protein device. Let's go. 2171, the University of Ceres agreed to sponsor me at the protein dig on Deterope. Very exciting. Professor Hennel is leading the expedition herself. Maybe I can even ask her for a, an opinion on my thesis outline. Attachment thesis on protein first contact protocols. 2174. I believe Dr. Joshon was right to suggest that the Prothean artifacts were un be unearthed are from the Third Age, not the Fourth. What an embarrassing mistake. At least he seemed to approve of the rest of my paper. Paper on a comparison of Prothean technology to mo modern Asari, Asari <laughs> fucking hell, circuit logic. Part one. I'm going to on, I'm going on the Theorem expedition. I never thought I'd gain permission to visit the Prothean ruins there, but the University of Ceres must have secured the funding after all. Now to pack paper on the end of the Prothean Empire. Part two: Goddess, the human ha shepherd, has the key to comprehending the Protheans on an instinctual subconscious level. If only I could have been there when the commanders touched the beacon on Eden Prime. I'll try to learn more about this cipher on board the Normandy. But the involvement of the Reapers is troubling, to say the least. I reviewed the old shadow, bro shadow Brokers footage of the Collectors. It's chilling to know that they're the Protheans' husks. Ugh. At least nothing sentient could possibly remain after what the Reapers did to him. Paper on Prothean biology. Interesting. Liara. It's good to see you. Okay, so nothing from Liara. <clears throat> All 
Alright, well, um, let's, we did a mission, so let's go to the various places where we don't have 100% at and see if we can't find stuff, I think. I found something. All right, what do we find here? Game. Is it another team from the Marines? Ten thousand credits. Investigate. Ooh, fuel. Sweet, free fuel. Always handy. Alright, so recovered all of the assets in Sigurd's cradle. How lovely. Let's go Hades Gamma. It's the one closest to being finished. And I've been to Hades Gamma like five billion times. Ah, tasty, tasty. Tea. Wah, ooh, wah. <laughs> um, I believe, yeah, Ferranada. Not sure that we'll have enough fuel to make it back. All right. Fuck, 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 fuck. Faster than light jumps All right, so now I know where I need to go. To, uh... Ooh, wow, I think we're about to find out what happens when we run out of fuel. Oh, damn, that was close. All right. I do like how the uh, the loading screens are more than just uh, the side of a ship now. Now I'm going to escape out of here real quick. Save the game, which it's doing for me. How nice of it. And now we're going to try and go somewhere with no fuel. Let's see what happens. Ah, so I just automatically return. Okay. We'll just have to jump back over here. Get some fuel. Ah, almost rattles my eardrum. Uh, jump over here, grab some fuel, and obviously go back. Bye, fuel. We're moving up in the world on the amounts of credits we have at least 73,550, or was it 735,000? Yeah, it was some. Uh, it was 73,550. All right. Plot mass relay jump. 60%. We already found the uh, javelin launchers from Kite's Nest. Without fail, it almost breaks my eardrums. Happy, happy joy. Untrell. Oh, hey. I like that. It remembers what you've scanned. And probe. What do we get? 10,000 credits. Woo! Oh. Oh, shit. Right. Pre Preepers? Reapers don't like us dinking around in these systems. 
creepers. Um, alright, so we can't do any more there. Uh, I kind of want to go back to the Citadel. Alright, here's what we'll do. We'll go back to the Citadel. If we don't get anything from there, we'll go here, and then we'll go here. But we do have those thingies, jigs. <laughs> Descriptive, aren't I? Uh, those things we picked up from scanning planets, I forget what they're called. We'll dock at the Citadel, and that'll tell me. Enter orbit. Dock. Um, I forget what it was. I think it was Batarian. We are transferring your docking clearance to an Alliance official. Figures. Finally back in action, the Alliance already wants us tagged and collared. What? Just our way of welcoming you back, Flight Lieutenant. Docking permission granted. Would you like private transport arranged? Uh... No? I'll handle it. Yes, Commander. I, you can get directly transported to places now? Interesting. Commander Bailey, Council of Udina. Ashley, Dr. Michelle. Uh, pillars of Strength. Tearing artifact recovered from kites nets. Find someone on the Citadel who can use them. How will I know who can use them? Let's just take a quick stroll around the Citadel. See if anybody highlights. Hello, Commander Shepard. Welcome to the Citadel. This is Docking Bay D-24. Note that due to recent events, official identification and weapons permits may be requested by CSAC personnel for routine verification. That's all. Please speak with me again if you require further assistance. Alright, so she's not going to help. All right. Um, you know anybody? No. Pillars of strength. Pillars of strength. No. Pillars of strength. Anybody need some pillars of strength? Pillars of strength. Welcome, Let's go to the embassies. Wander around there for a few, and then we'll go see Ashley. I doubt anybody needs an artifact. Pillars of strength? Pillars? Pillars. You look like you could use some pillars. Hello, Vallis. Alright. Uh, Prothean Obelisk. Shrike Abyssal. A Volus diplomat needs a Prothean Obelisk. Recover it from the Shrike Abyssal and deliver it to him in the Citadel Embassy. From the Shrike Abyssal. Where the fuck is a Shrike Abyssal? Was this the guy? I heard him breathe when I came over here. Where the fuck is the Shrike Abyssal? Hopefully it'll mark it on my map. Otherwise, I've got no bloody idea what the hell it's talking about. The reason I stopped there for a minute was because that chick looked like a uh, Helena Blake or something. Whoa, frames, 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 frames. All right, there we go. No, not, not, that doesn't, just because I say there we go doesn't mean you can start fucking up on the frames again. <sighs> no, no, okay. Commander Shepard. Hey, Hope Bailey. The Citadel's been treating you well. 
I'm still just trying to keep things in order. Feels like I'm fighting a losing battle. Thought things were relatively quiet here. Well, compared to where you're coming from, sure. But the war's being felt everywhere. <clears throat> Millions across the galaxy have been displaced, and most of them come here. Must have you doing somersaults. <laughs> yeah, already allocated the bulk of my men to customs, but we're still overtaxed, cataloging and processing them all. Let's see if we important. can get some information around here. <laughs> you kidding? With the Reapers running roughshod through the galaxy, it seemed like the Council is in constant session. We got more ambassadors and dignitaries here than ever before pleading their cases. But that's just the tip of the iceberg, really. Right. It'll probably get... Yeah, if it ever gets better. I probably said something along the lines, but it'll probably get worse before it gets better. Embassy. Human. Human embassy, I'm guessing. Hey, do you know anybody? All I can think is that the more things change, the more they stay the same. Okay. I've always loathed that phrase, fatalism. Not what men and women should aspire to. If we don't figure out something, maybe later will be an epitaph on a mass grave of 11 billion. I know what I'm going to do. What are you going to do? Humanity is as feared as we are loved. Hopefully that works in our favor now. I'll try to get financial aid from as many worlds as I can. Maybe manpower, a few armed ships. Pillars of strength, maybe? Institute a draft in our colonies and order all civilian ships armed. Work on the Prothean device will be around the clock. Let's find out more about Udina. We've had him in two games now, but we don't really know much about him. Did you know a lot of people on Earth? Many. It's monstrous to think of them being snuffed out, of course, but the part that gets me is Arcturus. I must know... I must have known most of the Alliance Parliament on a first-name basis. I required a second VI just to track all their birthdays and anniversaries. Rose Garden stuff, but to have it all gone. You're a Citadel Council. Don't you have options when the others block you like this? With Parliament destroyed and Shastri gone, I have more power than any human in history. But today, you saw how little that is. Rest assured, I will not be counted out long. I know I can move mountains. Do not lose sight of that, because the task before us is moving planets. Hmm. What's your read on the counselors? Any angles I could pursue? Counselor Irisa is not like her predecessor. She is colder. If she has her hand on your throat, she will squeeze. A shield. There you might find some traction. Practical. She might make Machiavelli turn pale, but that's a Delatras for you. Frankly, it's good Quentius spoke with you. His home world is in the most trouble, and he's looking for a way out. That speaks opportunity. All right. Any news from Earth? That is constant news. All of it bad. The Reapers are destroying satellites in the old nuclear missile silos, along with everything else that could help. We have a handful of quantum entanglers spread out over the continents. All other communication is cut. I should go. I'll be here. Pillars of strength. Nobody needs pillars of strength. Seriously? Nobody? <sighs> I don't, uh, there's anybody even in here to want pillars of strength, but I have to check anyways. Let's check out the Spectre terminal. Oh, right, Corian Fleet, Intel. The Perseus Veil, vale, somewhere. Non-human metagel upgrade increases the injuries among non-human patients at Horda. Has led to a improved metagel form. This would reduce fatalities and free up medical resources across the citadel. Well, I'll purchase it then. All right, let's go. Uh, let's go give that to the place, the Horta uh, Medical Facility. That sounds like 
that sounds like the makings of getting Ashley better to me. And I want her better. I want to know where the rest of my crew is. Right now, we've got this tool, James, who they're asking, like, acting like we've known forever. And Liara. And I like Liara. But I don't know who this tool is. I think it's James. That's his name. I... <laughs> If I had somebody on my team from any of the other games, I would know their name instantly. But I've never met this guy before, and it doesn't bother introducing. It's just like, oh yeah, he's... So, the nurse tells me you've refused to bathe, and you only want to talk to another Asari. Yes. Can I have a gun? I'm sorry. No. Maybe I could be transferred to another hospital then. Someplace unsecured. I could have a gun then, right? And no humans. Wherever you transfer me, it, it, it shouldn't have humans. The humans are our allies. You don't trust them? No, it's not that. I... How are my eyes? What, what, what color are they right now? Maybe you could tell me what happened. Okay. Welcome to Serta. Sorry, I'm just uh, checking a few things. Levo amino acid based life forms. How can we help you? Thank you for shopping. Okay. Thank you for shopping indeed. Alright, um yeah, I know it may seem like I'm not talking as much, it's just because I'm taking in everything. Hello again, Commander. Here to see our patient? How's Ashley doing? The egg drama was severe, but we reduced the swelling quickly. These types of injury can go either way. She hasn't regained consciousness yet, but her vitals are strong, so I'm optimistic. I think she said this before. You can before. go see her if you like. She's just on the arm. How are your medical supplies holding up? We're well stocked now, but I can't say. We've posted guards on our reserves. More profiteering at this war. We're fine now. I hear the docks are tightly controlled, but we've got 12. It can be overwhelming. You too. I thought that that medic, that metagel would be useful, but apparently not. Whoa. Anybody back here who I can talk to? Just gonna go through everywhere real quick. Do do do. Can't see Ashley still. Can I see her? <sighs> Alright, so that was completely a big waste of time. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, just rest assured that I won't be backtracking as much as I normally would, even for a uh, blind playthrough of something, simply because I'm recording, so. Alright. Let's go to D1 docking. Alright, so it looks like nobody needs any pillars of strength. Um, we did get a random quest. And we we've got this meta gel, which I'm not sure what the hell we're going to do with it. The people who I thought would take it didn't take it, so... Not sure what to do with that. Um, right, so let's go recover the Prothean artifact, I suppose. That's the only thing I can think of. Um, journal. And you find someone on the Citadel who can use it. Where am I supposed to find these people? It just says find somebody who can use it. Fuck off. Tell me. I just scoured the whole of the Citadel. Nobody could use it. So I'm guessing maybe in the future. Leave orbit. I don't know. We'll go through. Uh, we'll do these two side missions. There are this mission and then the side mission. And uh, actually, I want to check something relatively quickly. Um, all right. I was just checking to see if, uh, as I was. Like the Shrike Crystal, whatever that thing was called. 
uh, the Shrike Abyssal or something like that. Just checking to see if it could be... Alright, how does that hold up to you, Reapers? Signal confirmed. Enter orbit. I didn't get any, uh... I didn't get any Reaper attention from those two scans. That's interesting. What did we get? Lost and found. Sweet. Prothean data files. Alright. Excellent. Alright, we've covered 60... or 50 percent of... Here we go. This is probably fuel. Yeah. Alright, so it disappears even even if you don't use it. I have to keep that in mind. Uh, da, 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 da. Oh hey, we're going to Eden Prime. I somehow failed to notice that it was Eden Prime. Uh before Ooh, ow, that hurt. Sorry about that. Um before I go on, I'm going to call this an episode. So thank you for watching this episode of Let's Play Mass Effect 3. Please tune in the next one.